Hey, this is Steve Rainwater. I'm at the Dallas Personal Robotics Group RBNO, and I'm going to shoot some video tonight to uh, show you what projects people are working on. So stay tuned. So yeah, are you directly manipulating the so tell us a little about this thing. Uh, what's your what's your project? Um, this is Milo the robot. He is from Hanson Robotics from 2014 version one, um, and we're trying to get him back to working order. He's missing some parts here, so we need to get him a brain operating system and hopefully an LCD screen, so that if we touch the buttons, he will be able to smile and teach you how to be sad or to be expressive. Um, so in robotics, we learn everything from mechanics to, to design to coding, and David here is going to help me uh, reverse engineer some of these parts. Fingers crossed. <laughs> and where are you guys right now? <laughs> uh, we're at the DPRG meeting at the Dallas Makerspace. Yeah. Cool. And it's an excellent program. We get to learn from all the other people in here. Brilliant minds, a lot of cross-pollinating ideas, and we just hope to learn a lot and add to the flavor of this robot. It's experimental. Very exploratory. Very exploratory. And hopefully, um, as a result of coming to this group, we will go into animatronics or something uh, large scale in the future. This is Eric. My name's Ray. Um, Eric just got a Rami kit from Lulu, and um, he was missing one of the encoder magnets, so we can't do all the tests that we'd like to. But um, this is just a motor test. It's just spinning the motors forward and backward at a certain speed. Um, the, uh, um, I guess it was just missing in the kit. This little teeny magnet uh, was missing, so. Um, we can light LEDs and make the motor spin, but it's it's not going to have uh, you know uh, close loop control on the, on the platform. So um, we got to get another magnet, and we should be able to do a lot more with it. Okay. So. <laughs> So it's pretty balanced, you know, most of the weight's in the back wheel and the caster. And uh, DPRG, Dallas Personal Robotics Group, um, meets every Tuesday night. I usually get here around 6. Um, we usually stay till 10. And it's a time and place where we can meet and um, get platforms working, try different things, um, exchange code, um, and pretty much work on anything and everything. Uh, you know, related to robots. So, come out and see us here on uh, on Tuesday nights, anytime after six. Hey, well, I'm Carl. I'm here with the DPRG at the Dallas Makerspace. That's the Dallas Personal Robotics Club, and we uh, play around with robots that drive themselves around. This is one that I call Club Car Donkey Bot. I do that because it's based on a uh, club robot that got built by a handful of uh, design that was put together by a handful of members in 2016, and then I've uh, added the supper stuff, and then uh, I've kind of mashed it together with the idea of this donkey car that we do. So ultimately this thing, we use this camera, I'll drive it around with this guy and generate training data, 20,000 images or so, plug it up to a laptop, make a neural net, push it back to this Raspberry Pi, and Raspberry Pi can turn this off and the Raspberry Pi will drive it around. So, so far what I've done is uh, just mashing it together, adding my own little bits and pieces to it. Uh, so, so let's see. So here's how it drives around right now. And uh, it 
actually has, we have a contest where the idea is to just go out and come back. So it's, all it has to do is drive straight and come right back. So uh, I have it set with this little three color LED uh, switch. So I can hold that down and then let go. And it'll just go for 12 feet pretty precisely. And then it'll stop. And then it'll come back. Ain't that exciting? It's a little crooked, I don't know why. <laughs> so it should have come back restarted. Um, so anyhow, that's just one exercise we have. Another is to just to be able just to be able to drive it around. So uh, so basically, uh, the whole idea is to make it easy to drive in a precise kind of way. So it can it can drive pretty slow if I wanted to. I can uh, I can actually nudge it very gently and uh, line it different ways, or I can make it spin up. So it's a pretty capable platform, and now that it's uh, now that it's basically uh, maneuverable in a controlled way, uh, and I have a processor communication bus now with a spy port going on. Um, so I just have to get that protocol written, and uh, and then uh, I can start to train the neural net and make it drive that way. So. Carl, every Tuesday and every Tuesday evening here at the Makerspace and every second Saturday we have meetings. So you're welcome to come. As you can see, we have lots of people, lots of good knowledge. I'd love to see you. Hi, hi. I'm Doug. This is my robot. It's, a, it's another donkey car. And uh, this is a differential drive. It's really a test platform. And uh, having a lot of fun with it. Come out to DPRG Robotics Builder Night Out. We'd love to have you come visit. It's like Pinocchio. He just wants to be a real boy. You know? He does look like Astro Boy, though. Yeah. Fine.